Hi, I'm Leslie Sibillic. I'm Senior Curator at the Heinz History Center. And today, for Women's History Month, let's talk a little bit about Lillian Russell. Have you ever heard of Lillian Russell? If you were someone living in the 1890s or the early 1900s, I can guarantee you would know who she was. She was probably one of the most famous women in America at that point. I mean, as famous as many of the pop stars you might think about today. Lillian was both a singer and an actress, and so she was well known first as a performer. But in 1912, she became a Pittsburgher. She ended up in Pittsburgh because she married A.P. Moore, who was the editor of the Pittsburgh Leader. And A.P. was her fourth husband. Lillian led a very flamboyant life, but she came to Pittsburgh. And because her stage career was really winding down at this point, she found that this connection with the newspaper allowed her to be really vocal on some other things that she believed in. One, she believed that women had the right to vote. And Lillian's position was, you know, women like me pay taxes, and I'm sure Lillian paid a lot of taxes, but if I pay taxes, but I'm not allowed to vote, then that's the equivalent of taxation without representation. And instead, if I'm not given the right to vote, I'm not going to pay my taxes. Lillian was so famous that she probably was allowed to be a little bit more outspoken about those things than maybe the average woman would have been. But it was still a really important stance to take. And interestingly, she also believed that women should be able to enjoy physical exercise. And she was a big advocate for women being physically fit and being active. She rode a bike. She believed in exercise. And it was something else that here she used the paper as her platform to really make her beliefs clear. And so to me, she's this really fascinating example of someone who was known nationally as this big celebrity. But when she came to Pittsburgh, she sort of reinvented herself as a social activist. That's my Women's History Moment. Thanks for watching.